above this kind of controller here, and it remains to be seen when and where and by whom uh, they will first be applied uh, in any large scale. And first, uh, let me talk about uh, a little bit about the improvement even in the techniques of, of terrorism. Uh, I think there, there have been improvements. The, the, the um, Pavlov up there made some extremely profound observations, both on animals and on human beings. And he found, among other things, that, uh, that uh, conditioning uh, techniques apply to animals or humans in a state of either psychological or physical stress uh, sank in, so to say, very deeply into the mind body of the creature and were extremely difficult to get rid of. They seem to be embedded more deeply than, than other forms of conditioning. And, and this, of course, uh, this fact, I think, was discovered empirically in the past. People did make use of, uh, of many of these uh, techniques. But uh, the difference between the, the old empirical intuitive methods and our own methods is the difference between uh, a sort of hit and miss uh, uh, craftsman's point of view and the genuinely scientific point of view. I mean, I think there is a real uh, difference between ourselves and, say, the inquisitors of the 16th century. We know much more precisely what we are doing than they knew, and we can extend, because of our theoretical knowledge, we can extend uh, what we are doing over a wider area with a greater assurance of, of, of being, of, of producing something which really works. In, in this context, I would uh, like to mention the extremely interesting chapters in uh, uh, Dr. William Sargent's uh, uh, Battle for the Mind, where he points out how intuitively uh, some of the great uh, religious uh, teachers, leaders of the past, the hit on the Pavlovian method. He, he speaks specifically of Wesley's method of producing conversions, uh, which were essentially based upon a, a technique of, of heightening psychological stress to the limit by talking about hellfire, and so making people extremely vulnerable to suggest.